Good evening, I'm Dan Wolf. Thanks for joining us. After almost a year of back and forth between the city of Hibbing and union leaders, city employees could go on strike next week. Northern News Now's Larissa Mill has spent the day in Hibbing getting a first-hand look at what's at stake. Tensions between the city and its employees. Last April, the city of Hibbing brought a new pay structure they wanted to implement for employees to the local council 65 of AFSME. The union asked to open the contract up for negotiations in May, but they say the city wouldn't meet until November. We filed for mediation in November as well uh, because there were some proposals that the employer was trying to push that we didn't think uh, our members would agree with. Tom Whiteside, the local union rep for the city workers, says one of the big concerns is the city's proposed pay grid, which would allow management to determine whether employees receive a wage increase each year. He says that could be subjective, and some employees fear it could be used against them. One of our major concerns is that if management can, you know, at least the fear, employees will have fear of going to the employer and saying, hey, this is a major safety concern because they uh, will fear that they won't get their raises in the future. After trying to reach an agreement since November, the union filed an intent to strike at the beginning of the month. 65 city employees are represented by the union and would be impacted by the strike. They include garbage truck drivers, snowplow drivers, library employees, and city financial department employees as well. There's one final chance at mediation next Monday before the strike goes into effect next Tuesday. My goal is to go into mediation and get a deal that will work for our members. Um, and I'm hoping that the city will really drop their proposals that are uh, forcing our members into a corner and feeling like they need to or had to file this intent to strike. In Hibbing, Larissa Millis, Northern News Now. Hibbing city leaders were not available for an interview today, but in a statement tonight say they're committed to continuing negotiations and mediation in good faith as city leaders believe the offer they put on the table is a strong and fair one. We're going to keep following this story for you. Remember.